Hello friends, today we are going to see how to load legislative data group using ESDLs. So for this we required one template for LDG data group. So we can find that LDG data group dot dat template from Oracle. So you can download it from the view businesses, view business objects. So here you can see there are some required fields in this as legislative data group name then default currency legislation code and so structure instance name and source key so now we will prepare the template so which first we are inserting the data so we are mentioning the merge then object name the name of that ldg so we'll use us underscore ldg then currency which is the usd then legislation code which is the us the structure instance name which we can take it as a us cost flex instance which is the structure instance name and we'll use the source keys to load these particular HDLs. so we're inserting the source keys or source system owner as xx test and the source system id as xx test underscore ldg01 so in this way we have prepared our HDL, tem uh, HDL template so we'll save this particular template and make the zip file to load that particular LDG in the fusion instance so once we have made the zip files and open the application but before that we'll see if that particular LDG is available or not so go to the setup and maintenance Check for manage legislative data group. So here we'll search if that particular LDG is already available or not. So we'll check that particular data as US LDG which we are trying to load. So we'll see that if there is data or not. So there is no data we can found. So now we can load this particular legislative data or import that particular HDL template in this application right yeah so now we'll navigate to the my client group to load this particular data then data exchange once you navigate to the data exchange then click on import and load data and import that zip file so click on the import file browse the zip file where we have stored the zip file submit that particular request and you can set this parameter and submit this request now here you we will get the our hdl progress or hdl statuses so we will refresh that particular data set so once we have replaced this, we can see that our LDG zip file is in import process. So we can see that import status is in process. So as you see, we have loading only one line. So it is showing that in total lines, it is only one. So we are loading only one LDG over here. So we'll refresh and you can see here in our data is imported successfully it means there is no syntactical error in our hdl file so now data validation is going on in loading phase so you can see the loading status is in progress and here we go so we have loaded this ldg successfully into the system it means our data is also validated and loaded into the fusion instance right so we'll verify that particular instance of LDG so here we can search that US LDG and we can find that our LDG has been successfully loaded into the system right so in this way you can load the LDGs using HDL files you can load multiple LDG as well using this HDL template so thanks thanks for watching